Yes, what's everyone saying? Dr. Apple, good afternoon. Yeah, um, just got back from a little round of golf. I don't really uh, play on a professional level. It's more of a little hobby pastime, you know. We've just uh, just got back. Just had a round of golf with a couple of my buddies um, up in Croydon and um, got another hole in one, so another victory for the doc. Um, now, I'm not making this video <coughs> to talk about what everyone else is talking about. Paul Venice... Dekahegi because one, I don't believe there will be a fight. Two, it's quite obvious who would win. And um, three, if you know, everyone's jumping on this, um, jumping on this little topic at the moment. Uh, yes, I do believe the fair play was rubbish. If I'm honest with you, um, nothing against Paul. He's an all right guy, you know. Yeah, bit biased, but. Um, He's an alright guy, but um, imagine imagine Paul Venice and a Dr. Rappel when I was in my prime. <laughs> oh, imagine that, mate. Fucking, there would have been fireworks, wouldn't that? Bloody hell. Most people agree that I would have beat him quite comfortably. I'm not arguing with them. Um, anyway, who do I... What, so, like I said, I'm not going to talk about um, Venice versus Heggy. I'm not even going to speculate over who will win. You know, it's... It's a bit sad, isn't it, to just speculate over a, a fight that will never happen. A bit like, a bit like Tyson Fury and all these bloody fights he's wiggled out of in the last six months. Um, but now De De Decker, I think, would win. Um, pretty damn easily, to be honest. It's just too big and strong for Paul. But um, yeah, it's uh, Father's Day. Loads of gifts. Gifts. Um, yeah. Nice, some nice new clothes, some Fiero Rochers, <laughs> and some aftershave and things, you know, and, uh, yeah, some cream for me droopy eyes, and, uh, yeah, you know, some nice, some nice, some nice, some nice clothes, but, yeah, so, um, what a day, what a day, mate, what a day, fucking hell, I'm knackered, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to probably have um, an hour's power snooze, you know, because the golf took it out of me, mate. It took it out of me today. That was some um, extremely intense golf, you know. But um, so I'm going to have a power snooze, then get up, um, hit the weights, trying to get back into it, you know. But um, I normally get sidetracked by having a little tipple here and there, you know. So um, it's hard to stay motivated doing weight training these days, you know what I mean? Well, I've got lack of energy. I haven't got the energy I used to have. And the four lifts competition never came about. It was only me and Big Trips that was actually serious about it. All the other cuckoos um, chickened out, basically. They didn't want to be showing up without their steroids and all their other stuff there. They're no good, are they? So, you know, so it's that kind of, that competition got pulled, unfortunately. But, um, you know, it's hard to stay... Motivated anyway, when you get to a certain age, like I'm 36 now, you're old, kind of, you lose your kind of energy levels, you know what I mean? I have had a testosterone um, blood test, it came back um, normal, to be honest, so, I'm, um, um, you know, I, but people can tell, like, I'm, a, I'm like a powerful, powerful lion, you know, that um, you can tell that I've got plenty of tests in me, so... Yeah, but it is what it is. Uh, people, um, enjoy your Sunday afternoon. Like I said to um, Decker before, getting back to all this other stuff with that Joey Geezer. Don't trust anybody on YouTube. Don't trust anybody. There's very few people on YouTube that can be trusted. I'm talking about not out of the viewers. I'm talking about actual podcasters, YouTubers, you know, etc. You know, very few that can be trusted. I mean, I don't, I don't use Instagram anymore. Can't use Instagram. It just it just takes over your fucking private life. You know, I was just getting calls up to forty times a day on Instagram. Some people wanting to be friends. Some weirdos wanting to call me out. You know, like I'm going to answer to, you know, entertain these people that I don't even know. You know, it's so I've disabled my Instagram. So if anyone has messaged me on Instagram, I apologise, I, I probably won't be getting back to you um, in the near future, because it's, to be honest, it's a headache, it's a fucking headache, and um, yeah, I'm staying off of that for one thing, and um, I'm gonna, you know, I don't know, maybe I'll 
I lower the amount of YouTube videos I do as well because that's quite stressful, demanding, do you know what I mean, for a, for a genius like myself, you know. But it is what it is. So, um, people, enjoy your Sunday. God bless. Take care.